Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you about hypoxic ischemic encephalopathy imaging. Hypoxic ischemic encephalopathy HIE is a condition of neonatal brain injury by perinatal high spoke six ischemic enzymes. Clinical issue. Deep pattern is associated with dyskinetic cerebral palsy indicate involvement of subthalamic nucleus. <laughs> Demography A. Ischemic ischemia may occur in intermediate prenatal intraquatrum and postnatal period sex, predominant in male more than female. Epidemiology HIE present up to two over one thousand liver imaging deep or central pattern of injury basal ganglia dot telomas plus minus brain stem peripheral pattern of injury Injury to water seed zone of hemisphere. Mix. Deep gray plus contact pattern is often encountered. Ultrasound may be used for screening. Less sensitive for early injury or certain pattern. is best imaging test for parenchymal injury. T1 and T2 usually no more in first few days. T1 increase signal in affected region. T2 increase or decrease signal in affected region. DWR. Best sequence to Define extent of injury. Increase DWI, decrease ADC in affected region from 1 to 10 days. Dynamic solution depending on location. Amores. Decrease NAA and increase like lactate in affected area. Diffusion. Increase ASL in affected deep gray nucleus during first week. This is the WI in a five day old term neonate with HID from mechanism aspiration. So, symmetric diffusion restricts in the water seat for text and white matter. The involvement of cerebral cortex with sparing of the deep gray nucleus is consistent with partial prolonged pattern of hypoxia. This is C2MI in a seven day old term with HIE from placental 
abruption, so symmetric T2 signal hypo intensity in the posterior portamina and anterior lateral thalami, typical of an acute profound pattern of asphyxia. Short echo pump and spectroscopy in the left basal ganglia in a cordial term girl with seizure, so decrease an AA and a large lipid lactate peak confirming injury to basal ganglia. This is the ultrasound in a one-day-old-term boy born. A systolic via images C-section through slit-like lateral ventricle. hyper and a region of exaggerated gray matter, white matter, differentiation, finding consistent with HIE. This is non contrast enhanced CT. So, classification of the thalamus. and posterior basal ganglia from status mammoratus. There is diffuse atrophy and a collapsed valgarium following remote mixed HIE. And this is the non-contrast enhanced CT in a CDO term. Yeah, with HIE. So, hypo attenuating deep gray matter nucleus that cannot distinguish from adjacent Y matter. A reliable CT finding of HIE. Treatment. Resuscitation, correct fluid of fluid electrolyte imbalance. Treat seizure, therapeutic hypothermia. Thank you.